Good day, everyone. Good to see everyone again. Jay Kennedy here, Sifu, Artist of Truth. I know it's been a little while since I posted a video, and I miss all of you tremendously. I, I miss this time. This is my meditation and my opportunity to give back and to share love with everyone. So, thank you for being there for me, and all of you who have subscribed to my, my video channel on YouTube, Artist of Truth. And I've been through some personal issues here. I had a family member pass away, and and uh, lots of things going on. A good friend of mine, his uh, mother's very sick, going through some some personal things in her life, and cancer. And trying to do what I can to help everyone. So I had to take some time off to to really. Uh, get to know where I am in life. It had to make me think about a lot of things. It's been very joyful to to be a part of this life at this time. To be on this earth and to have such good friends and family who can come together whenever uh, such tragic moments occur. <clears throat> so uh, thank you all for being involved with me and helping me on this journey here to share this moment. I hope that all that I'm doing is, is very helpful for you, very beneficial. We can share the love with each other. Uh, I did a, since the last video I've actually done a couple of little short water fasts, and some different things like that. Just didn't make it very public. So I, uh, I hope that my energy that I've generated Will, will disperse outwardly and help all of you. If you are going through something like I mentioned earlier, my, my good friend's mother having cancer and some illness and such, that is really the time to consider what you are doing and where you are in life. Because everything about our life is miraculous and our bodies and our minds can completely change everything about us. If we can change the way we think, and then we change the way we act, we can change our lives, and thereby change other people's lives for the, for, uh, the benefit of all. So we must, we must always be thinking about what we are doing, and what we are saying, and especially what we are thinking. Because if we're, we're thinking these degenerating debilitating thoughts all of the time, then it will definitely show in our lives, and it will show in our health. There are many different ways to eat, and many different ways to think, and many different jobs, and many different types of people, so one way doesn't suit everyone, just like one religion doesn't suit everyone. That's why there's so many different religions in the world, and people have different philosophies and different cultures. So it's up to us to be able to find the middle path and, and to, sorry, I'm dodging a, something that can't even come in here to bother me. It's just my reflex as a bird flew very close to my windshield. Um, but anyway, lost my train of thought there. I thought I was going to be bombed. <clears throat> but many different things, the middle path. There, we have to find a way to relate to, to all things in our lives. And when you start, when you're in a poor health situation, it's really time to consider what you're eating. You know, the starchy grains and <clears throat> uh, you know, refined sugars and such weaken the kidneys, make you pasty, affect your, your eyesight and your, and your health in many different ways generate your thought patterns. It's unclean food. And even meats. Meats can still make you sick. And I, I'm, you know, I'm sorry to all the meat eaters. Uh, it does. It takes a little bit longer to do it. And there's many different, there's healthier meats and <clears throat> different ways to consume a dead animal. But if you want to live, you need to eat living food. Meats is high in uric acid and over extended periods of time to fix your colon and all. Do the real research, not short studies. And uh, if you're consuming, you know, much less meat and higher, like the paleo diet, and higher consumptions of grain and things 
like that is still bad for you. But if you're eating fruit and the nuts and such, and the athletes are working out, lots of them, I know one of a good friend of mine personally is doing something much like that, you can still be healthier. But if you're sick, I'm talking to those people with um, you know, degenerative illnesses and such, if you want to live, put living things into your body. High concentrations of fruit, vegetables, herbs, clean living food, and you will live, and you will have a better life, and a clean life. And I'm not going to go too much into anything today. Just wanted to talk with you, with you really, and to just share that one thought. Uh, I'm going to be back on my my daily videos, and again, I apologize. I just, you know, with the, the death of a, my father's brother and uh, many other personal events going on, postpone my, my videos there for a little while to gather myself and to think and to be of benefit. I only want to put out that positive energy. So have a good day to my friends and my students at, over at the Kung Fu Institute, Kennedy Wing Chun. You're doing really well. Stick with it. We're changing our lives, helping each other to grow. All right? Love everyone.